There are two options for mankind. There are two options for each and every one of us. We can choose human wisdom or we can choose God's wisdom, the wisdom of the cross. But they don't fit together. They can't be made compatible. They are incompatible. God's cross wisdom contradicts human wisdom. God's cross wisdom contradicts human wisdom. The human race is divided into two groups. That's how Paul sees all of mankind. It's not about gender. It's not about age. It's not about wealth. It's not about education to Paul. No, he says the world is divided right down the middle. And the dividing factor is what people think of Jesus Christ and Him crucified. Your perspective of that event is the most important thing about you. It's the defining thing about you. And Paul shows that the wisdom of the world, human wisdom, completely disagrees and contradicts God's wisdom, the wisdom of the cross. The Corinthians want to to mix and match human wisdom and cross wisdom. Paul says, no, it doesn't work. They contradict. No matter what the race or the culture, the message of the cross is always folly and offense to natural sinful man. Paul shows that the cross wisdom and human wisdom of the world contradict one another. They oppose one another and they oppose one another. They contradict each other on the most basic level. Look at verse 18. It says, for the word of the cross, this message of the cross is folly to those who are perishing. To the world that's perishing, that's dying. It's dead spiritually. The cross, the word of the cross is folly. It's ridiculous. But to those who are being saved, it is the power of God. This is, this is no small difference of opinion on a minor topic. (laughs) No, this is absolute contradiction on the central issue. When the world looks at the cross, it says insanity, completely unnecessary, worthless, pointless. But to those who are being saved, when they look at the cross, they say, no, that, that is the power of God to save.